Hey TPT sellers, in this quick tip, I'm gonna show you how to level up your store and get more sales by using this space correctly. I'm gonna show you what to put in here. I'm gonna show you how to get jumbo fonts. I'm gonna show you how to create an animation. Check this out. This personal quote space on your store is one of the most important places to build trust and to give people an emotional reason to buy from your store. Do not put your teaching philosophy here. The way that we build trust is with social proof. Some of us have a lot of reviews and votes and likes and whatnot, but not everyone does. And when I was first starting out and I had nothing, I made sure to put in here the number of downloads. So you want people to know that other people are using your stuff and therefore they can trust you to use their stuff as well. Second thing is the emotional reason is usually why should I buy from this store or what differentiates you from the other people? Um, usually people want to save time, save money. So that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna go into my store profile. All of the links are in the video description and you want to make sure for your personal quote, it says image and link, not text. The file size is 450 by 150. I go into Canva, create a design. I go custom size. I go 450 by 150, create a new design. Canva by default will give you a white background. You don't want a white background. You want to blend in with the color choices that TPT has made. So the way that we can find out the exact hex code is I right click hit inspect. And then on the side here under styles, there's probably a box that says color with a boxer. I click on the color box and there's an eyedropper tool. I click on the eyedropper tool and now I can color match the exact hex code on the screen. So I'll click here for this gray. I see the hex code is here. I'll copy that. I'll go into Canva. Oops. I'll click on the white background. I'll change the color to that color. Here we go. And now it's the exact shade of gray. I'm going to add some text here. So let's add some text here. I'm going to say save time. Let's make this a lot bigger. And then I'm going to say duplicate that. Obviously you're going to spend more time making this fit your brand and your message exactly. Save money. All right. This is too big. I want to change it to 100% to see the exact size it's going to be. And that'll make sure that I can change the layout. I'm going to add some animation here. So let's just animate. We're going to add an obvious animation for now. So it's easy to see in this demo. So I have some animation. I'm going to click on share download this not an mp4 video but a gif which is an animated file uh, download this file it's going to save it to my computer there we go uh, you can see my practice file but i'm going to call it save time i use google chrome it shows up right here at the bottom i go to my store profile and i just click and drag that up to here where it says choose file and now when i hit save I can see that it has updated my file. And when I go to my whole, my store page and I just refresh this page, I'm going to close the inspection panel just so you can see it full screen. Now you can see it's animated. It looks like the text. I would probably spend a lot more time matching things out and thinking about what my message wanted to be, but that's how you do it. If you like this video and you just want this Canva file, please leave a comment on this video and subscribe to the channel. So here's my channel here. I have 259 subs. If I can get to 500 subscribers, I will put a link to the Canva file, a free Canva file uh, in the product description. And then that way you can just adapt and spend your time fixing it up for your store instead of trying to color match the background TPT. <laughs> All right, I will see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye now. There we go. So now you can see. All right. I will see you next time. I don't know what else I'm going to say.